for your leafy greens. When your doctor tells you to eat your leafy greens, they're practicing what the doctors preach. Between the two male gorillas we have here, they eat 60 pounds of produce a day. So we're talking endive, dandelion greens, romaine lettuce, they eat green beans, and that's the bulk of that 60 pounds. We've seen incredible health benefits. Given that, we want to try to buy as much of that produce as we can from local sources. It's fresher, there's a smaller carbon footprint, it's coming from down the road, and we're investing back in the community. We're keeping our dollars locally. We have two adult male gorillas here, Makalo and Bebek. Bebek is 30 years old and Makalo is 27 years old. There's a lot of animals that people come to zoos to see. Elephants, giraffe, but gorillas are definitely at the top of that list. They're big. So there's that tremendous wow factor, but then you see them move around and they're very human-like. You know, they're grabbing things with their fingers. The gorillas and zoos do have heart disease. It's something that both of our male gorillas have, and it's something that we've been monitoring here at Cleveland Zoo for a while. When we changed the gorillas diet, there were both behavioral and health benefits. The gorillas spent about double the amount of time feeding, so they were a lot more behaviorally active. Additionally, from a health perspective, we did see that their insulin and cholesterol levels were lowered after we made the diet change. We have a lot of people here that lead what's called the Great Ape Heart Project, and we work with other zoos on that. Zoos talk to each other. Oh, I heard that the Cleveland Zoo is doing this with their diet. How can we implement it? The changes that have come about in terms of gorilla management between when these guys got here in the early 90s to now is night and day. We've learned so much, we're learning more and more all the time, and that's because of our research program and our connections to universities like Case. We don't know everything about gorillas, but man, we're working really hard to make sure that we do.